Hey guys, Max Runtrons here, and I know that I'm not always up to date with trends, so let me just r jump right into this trend, which is the scenario thread trend from Twitter. So basically, um, a guy called Nasmaraj has made scenario threads like the one we are going to be playing today called the Prison Break. And let's just uh, go through these so, so that I can basically just talk to you about what you're supposed to do and also play along. Prison Break, a scenario thread. Recently, you were sentenced to a death penalty for killing a man who murdered your only daughter and last family member. So basically, I'm a man who's... Oh, I, yeah, I'm, I'm a person who killed a man who killed my daughter and my last family member. In which case, my daughter could also be my last family member, but let's just get going. Pay very close attention. The system has failed you. You're now in a prison with 3,484 inmates. This is your last chance of escape. Good luck. Click here to start. So, um, when you click here, it takes you to another tweet below which he has replied. It's basically a story mode session kind of thing with just Twitter. So, lightning has knocked out the fuse box connecting to the electronically operated doors. Death row restrict okay a place where I wouldn't really want to be in so all the doors open and inmates at your block I mean the inmates in our block run to the left are you going with the crew or are you going right by yourself haha <laughs> I get the pun there right by yourself that's uh, that's a good one let's go to the right because inmates are going there and there's could be a mob created and yeah basically that's my reasoning with it while going to the right you get around the corner and you come across a guard warn him not to fuck with you or fight him so basically I'm gonna fight him because warning wouldn't work he could just get a security security walkie talkie out and call more people to help him out so that wouldn't really make sense so we have beaten the guard so bad that he's lying in his own pool of blood and we are definitely gonna finish him and kill him or whatever we reach the staircase are we going downstairs or ups upstairs or downstairs whatever um, so basically people have actually chosen going downstairs more than upstairs I mean that it's a systematic approach because moving downstairs you might just be able to leave quicker but we don't know what floor we are on and because it is a prison like we are in the death row so basically there has to be a helipad up there which could possibly have a helicopter and there are a lot of people running around so basically if we go up I mean the people aren't gonna notice us that well I mean if we go down I, I don't know how to get my point across but we're gonna go upstairs um, let's be different than the crowd upon arriving on another level Floor, you hear, you hear, guards passing by or walking past, whatever. Be patient and wait for them to leave, or continue going upstairs. To be honest, I'd continue going upstairs because I can just hear the guards. I don't know where they're going. So while going upstairs, we hear a helicopter landing on the building. Exactly what I meant uh, a while ago. So this could be our way out. And we're definitely gonna. Oh, trick question. You're. Okay, never mind. Let's click yes. And go in the helicopter, basically. And go for the helicopter, not go in the helicopter. Let's continue. We reach the top floor of the prison. Three prisoners are already planning to escape in the helicopter. And I join into the conversation. So these are the three people. And we join in. Which means we're now we're four of the us. And there are two guards standing in the way of us and the helicopter. They are not even armed, which means four of us can actually just take on two of them because if you're in the death row, you have to have done something miserable like a murder or something. So, yeah, ambush and jump. That, like, that's the obvious choice. And let's continue. We're on the roof inside the helicopter and there's a keypad pin number you have to put in to start the helicopter so this time let me just go right across without looking at the choices we have and just go to the if you chose this thing 
because it could just give give up the answer. Seven seven three eight. Interesting. Three four eight four. Uh, weren't those the number of people who were um, who were the inmates? Nine twenty six sounds like a year, but I don't think they'll keep it that way. Nine one seven five seems too out of position. So does seven seven three eight. To be honest, I mean three four eight four is actually the only number I can recall mentioned being mentioned in the whole scenario thread. So I'm gonna go for that. Okay, huh? I'm a genius. The pin worked. Me and the other three inmates have escaped successfully. I mean, that's great. So basically, guys, um, that's pretty much it for this video. I mean, if you had any other, if you want to watch more of this, leave a comment down below and get this video to 15 likes. I'll do more of these. These are enjoyable and addictive. Yeah, that's basically it for this video, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Adios.